American couple likely dead after yacht hijacked by escaped convicts in Caribbean. According to authorities, the American couple that vanished a week ago after three escaped prisoners took over their catamaran are most likely dead. According to Police Commissioner Don McKenzie, the inmates had broken out of imprisonment in the Caribbean island of Grenada on February 18 and had taken over a catamaran named Simplicity, which was carrying Kathy Brandle and Ralph Hendry, the following day. The couple's boat was later seen departing Grenada late at night at an unusually high pace. They were last spotted the night the convicts fled. Information suggests that while traveling between Grenada and St. Vincent, they disposed of the occupants, Commissioner McKenzie said. He claimed that the three fugitives were apprehended by St. Vincent and the Grenadines police on Wednesday and that a Grenadan team had been sent to assist in having a complete and thorough investigation of the matters at hand. Three people were being held at the South St. George Police Station on Grenada's southwest tip, Ron Mitchell, 30, Trayvon Robertson, 19, and 25-year-old Abita Stanislaus. They were being charged with robbery with violence when they made their break. In addition, Mitchell is accused of indecent assault, attempted rape, and rape. St. Vincent Police released a statement in which they stated they found the ship abandoned, with objects scattered around the deck and maybe even blood on it. The accused were remanded into detention with a sentence scheduled for March 4 after they entered guilty pleas to four immigration crimes in St. Vincent's court on Monday. Although it is assumed that the couple has passed away, St. Vincent Police Superintendent Junior Simmons stated that the investigation and search for the missing persons continues.